and you, uh, I'm, you were okay with that? He's crazy like a big back, right? What? What is what? <laughs> what? You were okay. You were okay with that. Um, um knowing that um, you you were possibly going away for four years to go along with the marriage. Well, we were setting it up. We uh, I was setting up. To be honest, you know, I'm gonna be gone for four to twelve years. Let me be married. So I can, you know, conjugal visits or, you know, any type of, and then, um, cause I did a lot of research. I watched 60 days and I was driving myself crazy watching jail shows because nobody in my immediate family or my generation been to jail. Hmm. So I'm like the first, you know what I'm saying? So I know that if you have family, but because I have a grown child, um, I had to get married in order to stay in a certain perimeter. Cause they can't ship you to, you know, when you state property, they move you wherever they want to move you. Yeah. So when you have a child like China, a young child, you, they can't really send you to Ohio or anything crazy like that. When you oh. marry or when you have a child, they, at least you in New York. Gotcha. Gotcha. So okay. Mary, Is that for uh, men and women? Oh, uh, I don't know about the men, but okay, I know right. and for the women, well, when we talk about shop, it's it's a whole different. You get is it's a whole different um avenue. You know. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, you guys, you guys both go in, right? So, China, you said that you had to do a certain amount of time, then go to shock. Is that correct? Yeah, because I had five years. Like mm -hmm. you, you're not eligible for shock unless you're like. Um, 36 months, mm -hmm. that's something like that. Like, you gotta be like, yes, yes, anyway, like I, whatever the case may be, I had to have time in, so I had to do 16 months before I was even eligible to go. Okay, so Straya, yeah. in your situation, were you able to do shock right away? I was able to do shock right away. Well, I went to Rikers first and then Bedford. You had it's a waiting list. But I didn't have to do time because they reduced the four to twelve to um, a one to three. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, all right. Before you get the shock, how's that experience? You can you guys can choose who goes first. <laughs> well, I'll say mine is easy. Um, Rikers wasn't what I expected, you know, but I never. Um, by the grace of God, I never went into general population, you know? So the only thing I could say about Rikers is that it was dirty. You know, the food, that was the food and it was dirty. That's it. But I met a lot of um, women that um, when I left, we cried, you know, um, we did. I bonded with a lot of women um, in Rikers. And then in Bedford, I didn't, uh, I found myself getting comfortable, so to say, because it was just, um, it was chilling. You know, I found myself, I had commissary, I had a visit, because Bedford wasn't so far, so every day, I, every other day I had a visit, I had commissary, and um, I found myself like, okay, I'm, I'm, I, I'm chilling here. I can get in some trouble. And then again, by the grace of God, they was like, okay, we gonna ship you out. So I didn't I didn't have any bad experience um in Rikers or Bedford. Okay. So China, you did a you did a little bit more time in um outside of the shock program. So how was your experience during those first like 16 months uh before you went to shock? So first I went to the county. The county fucking sucks. Yeah, I know about Nassau County. It's mm -hmm, mm -hmm. the worst county ever. And I hated it. I was I was happy though because originally when I when I got locked up, my bail was two hundred thousand dollars. But I wanted to bail out because I had forty co defendants and I didn't know who was telling on me. Mm -hmm. So I wound up bailing out. And they gave me some time. So I wound up getting sentenced January 5th, 2022 to go in and do my time. 